Welcome back to my Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough. Now I see Micah on the map. I'm going to go to Micah. I don't like Micah. You know, Micah's a piece of shit. I feel like I should do what I can to... Actually, hold on. I kind of feel like I should try to... Margaret... Albert... Hold on, but we've got... It on the it's on the photo. One second, one second, one second. Oh wow. so cool. That's not what I wanted. I wanted this. I wanted this. Nope. Didn't want that. I wanted this. Nope. How do I get into my fucking... my inventory? Okay, now... No, I can go in my inventory. This is the part where I get confused. And then I look at the controls and I'm like, oh, it doesn't tell me what I have to do with the keybind. And now I'm going back numerous episodes. Like they don't even go over the key bindings. Which is really annoying. Hey, horses. Thank you, guys. Nope. I've literally done it before. Why? I don't want the journal. I don't want the journal. Jesus fucking Christ. This is stupid. I'm an idiot. I admit I am an idiot right now. Fuck you. <sighs> okay, so wasn't it there? Only posters, photographs.
Flat Iron Lake. There we go. See, this is what I should have did. <clears throat> right away. Because she's over in this area. That's all of them. Cool. There we go. That's all I really wanted. Alright, well then, let's... Uh, get to it eventually here. Six minutes in. She's got a nice shootout over there. Dutch fan. Mm, she over there? Yeah, that's where she's at. In... Mm, I guess we'll go do Dutch. Mm, wait, what's up? Billy Midnight should be. Oh. Well, and I'm going to try to go and pay anyway, so. Fuck it. Horse? Sorry. Let's go, lady. Let's go, bro. Good morning, Arthur. Where was that? go fishing again soon. That was fun. Yes, I needed that. To clear the mind after everything. Oh, Hosea. Hosea's good people. There's a lot of good, complicated people. You get used to a camp, and then... You have to get used to a different camp. All seems quiet, Charles. Where the fuck's Bill been? Bill hasn't been doing shit. Bill that Bill's not dead. Nope. Just try not to die, Tony. Yeah, there's a girl. See if we get held up again. These dumb fuckers. that guy doing oh that's just a rock is that a person hey mister morning what are you doing what the fuck are you doing what's he doing What the fuck he's doing? Yeah. Did hear gunshots over this way though. People holding up a train? Anyone moves, I go right before search. Hurry up and hey, don't best you keep hey. Fucking guys. I forget where they're from. Like, if it's a bigger gang. I mean, it's clearly a gang, but like... Oh. 
if I rob the train... What? Why? Really? Okay, well... Cut free. What happens if I... Nope, I don't want to fuck with this, because, like, if I fuck something up, that conductor, I ain't fucking with that. All right, horse. You did a good thing today. Crazy times, fellas. Crazy times. Morning, partner. Hi. What in the hell? You know what? Oh, I was, I was just saying hi. Come on. Sorry, buddy. Hey, why is he fucking... Is he, is he following me? Chase me down. I have a bounty. I'm gonna pay the bounty just to get it off my ass. Mister. Good morning, friend. Hey, fella. Best you behave yourself now. Get bent, fuckface. I thought this guy would... He used to have jobs. You rang? I didn't yet, technically. But, uh... Howdy. Good lord. It can't be worth it. How's your look? I cannot complain. That's good. Hey, you there. A quick word. What can I do for you, sir? Do you for war? an old gunslinger I'm looking. Can I? Oh, I can't do free cam. Yeah. Can I get in there? Can I get in that room? Can I get in that room? Can I pet that dog? Good for. I heard he comes through here. Name of Midnight? Billy? Oh, that old soak? Yeah. He spends days on board these trains, but he's going nowhere but the gutter. I imagine you'll find him right in the next one through here. Either that or the next one. Try them both. Look in the bar car. Morning, good morning. Good morning, sir. Oh, no. Oh. It'd be cool to just ride a fucking bar car. Mr. Midnight? Excuse me, I'm trying to drink. Mr. Midnight, listen, this won't take a moment. I just want to talk with you about your old days as a shootist. Get away from me! Hey! I didn't shoot him in his sleep! No one's I saying didn't shoot it. him in his sleep, and if I did, it was the only way! Okay. All right, buddy. No one shot him yet. I knew you cut for me. Get away from me. Mr. Midnight. All right, we're on a chase. I forgot about this one. Wow, fans on a stealing fans on a train. Who would have thought I'd see the day? Oh, you're going to 
I don't remember. No, let's not do this. What? Oops. You come for me? Wait, I should have shot the gun out of his hand. Fucker's fast, though. He's a good, good shooter. Better than that douchebag at the fucking fair or the carnival. Whoa. Okay. Um, I don't really appreciate that happening so fast. That's because I pushed the button. Oh, I'm not skipping the checkpoint. I'm gonna do this. Mustache in my face. There we go. I didn't want to kill him. Motherfucker. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Damn it. What is my cool hat again? God damn it, I keep losing hats. Well, okay. That's not I'm pretty sure I could have damn it, I should have shot the last one off. What are you gonna do though? Can't go back in time. Could check out them because I'm right here. Could do that. That story is a story. Yeah. There we go. Not the best photo. Kind of interesting, sort of. The sign. Eh. All right, to the farm. Well, to the estate. Seventy-four. Ooh, toasty. It looks toasty. Howdy, partner. What do you want? Hey, look, I've been helping the sheriff with some trouble. 
Wanted me to have a word with few of the folks on the property here. Emmett Lee. All right. Have a word. But I ain't got the time to help. I ain't do nothing wrong. Uh, wide wide shot with these two fellers it's too wide it's true landscape shit but then get it tight tweet tweet open that shit up The focal distance, crank the blur, very cool, I mean maybe want a little bit of it to kind of look like it's in like look it's a boss it's a boss battle riding up to a boss battle clean you up little girl suck when you die howdy sir how you do it for mm. hey uh, I was hoping you'd talk a moment I'm a student of the history of the region and uh, I ain't the one to speak to try master Bo think he's down there by the wood store boy's got all the time in the world mm -hmm. Ooh, we got ourselves a file what is this what is this accent honestly so it's funny too this is like still well yes, it's in the south so colonial makes sense it's also just kind of funny looking kind of funny looking what's in here probably can't go in there that's a cool building what's it, what do they do to this How the fuck did you get over here? Who told you to come over here? Huh? Who told you that? I didn't tell you that. It's like the three crones. No. This is way nicer than their house. Oh. Water's disgusting. I suppose if they're using it for blacksmith, then that makes sense. Hey, pal. Huh. I'll see you at the sheriff's office. Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. We friends? We don't get a lot of traveling men here. Then suddenly, there's a whole 
phalanx of mysterious but strangely helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? I was just looking for work. Well, looking for something. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? <laughs> Never mind. The thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaite's. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. Love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. She's a Braithwaite. I'm Bo Gray, son of Tavish Gray, nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaite's for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty, and stupidity. Ain't that how it goes? To some nonsense while she. She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow. If tomorrow turns out fine. Well, she's like sorry, yesterday. Forever. Would you help? I don't want to get involved in <laughs> gang feuds. It seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We Greys, we've always got money. No brains, mine, but money. Well, in that case. I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Oh, yeah. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. Oh, look out for their guards. They're worse with strangers than ours are. So long. Yep. And good luck. Thank you. Come on. Shut the fuck up, dickhead. She's going to drink the cat water. Fill their water bowl in the morning. The fucking... I've got these neighbors that have multiple trailers parked in front of their house in town. The house looks like a country house you'd see in the country that's just filled with shit except it's located conveniently within the town I live in um and I think that's what that just was that was the sound of the trailer to the front. Were you doing it again? Were you being a bad dog? Lay down. Lay down. True. Lay down.
Apples. Prude, lay down. Come on, swim faster. Soaked. It's heavy clothing, oof. Oh, ma'am. Penelope Braithwaite. Well, yes, I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And a gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know each other. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's not from me. It's from, uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh, he is so... Strange? <laughs> yes, he's a little strange, but also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the Dark Ages, or... Well, I don't know, cave people, perhaps. Bo's different. But if they find out, they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful, like Ohio. Have you ever been to Ohio, sir? No. Well, neither have I, but my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are, are, there's something else. <laughs> you got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say, except I hope they all rot. I don't, I, well, maybe a bit, but here. If you see Bo again, will you give this to him? Sure. Yeah, now I have to get out of here without being seen. How am I going to do that? They're over there. Drowned. Drown. Nice, got a silver. Oh, yeah.
Hmm. Found a crazy young woman, real strange looking, locked in what kind of an outhouse. Eating on the Braithwaite Manor. Oh, good place for folk liquor. Yikes. Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, so like, you got alternate side parking in the winter, right? And so they will move their trailers every night. And it's it's quite the thing. There's so much shit. They have dogs running out. It's, it's fucking... It's a, it's a fucking... It's an experience. It is an experience. Ow! Oh. Where's my fucking horse? Yeah, there you are. Ooh, in the tree. Am I gonna get caught? Nope. Alright, well, let's see. Where do we want to go? Just continue on with the bow deal? Bow dealer? Go to bow. Get that there marked on the map and hit the road. Chap. That's a cool barn. <clears throat> oh yeah, we got a shootout here in the future, I think. Yeah, we got something going on up here. <clears throat> Second. Giddy up, cowbokes and poke daddies. Cowbokes and poke daddies. What do you mean? Don't worry, I'm good. Just fucking your farm up. Hold on, hold on. You okay? <sighs> Sorry, horse. Apparently I'm a bad jumper. Ah, old battlefield shit? Yeah. That's cool. Bitch, gotcha. Eventually, we'll take your ass to town, actually. Close enough to town, it can take it right to the fucking butcher. Should be a solid pelt, too. I killed it with an arrow. Poor quality? Poor quality. Bullshit. It's funny you don't do anything with the carcass. Oh, wait. You do. Alright, we're taking this to town. No one fucked this up for me. By that, I mean, I don't need to fucking run into any goddamn raiders or dickheads on the side of the road. Mm -mm. No, thank you. No, sir. Let's go. Get a trailer for your horse. Go out and get a buffalo. And 
the buffalo home. Or the buffalo's room. I don't want to run into what's his name yet. So I'm not even sure if I will run into him here. That's the first encounter for the with the guy that's looking for his friend. People in the hotel. Always one takes an opportunity to take a fucking photo, because of course I do. Hey, Mr. Actually, Will you give me some money? I might. Hold on. First, I'm going to do this. Sure. Oh, I guess I will, but hold on. I know you can hear me. I didn't hear shit. Want some meat? Looking to sell any meat? Yeah. He's not nearly as bloody. Here we go. Thanks, Mister. Salt beef. Here. Here you go, friend. Sure. Oh, thank you. Say, Real say where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from right here. That yeah, was you like me. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, yeah ever since them, them greys moved here. They a bunch of no good white trash. Well, sure. Somehow got rich about 50 years ago. They moved here caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, I reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Hmm. Interesting. Hi, Mister. You doing all right? Not good. No, I know.
This here feller is a fucking freak. Howdy. Let me know what catches your eye. I will. Can I sell anything to you? I can't sell anything to you. <laughs> Didn't want that. <clears throat> Go to the side of the house or building. Then we're gonna find the guy who's in the basement. I'm looking forward to testing this out. Looking forward to fucking your ass up. Thank you shit. For your help. Oh look, everything's all nice and cordial black. Okay there. <laughs> I tell you, I wouldn't get caught walking around like that. Well, fuck you, dick. Mister. Up. Why are you dressed up like that? <laughs> I seen. Why is there? I mean that the texture work is awful right there, but some sick perversions in my time. This one might take the prize. Wait, wait. You've got to help me. It's that crazy gunsmith. He made me dress up like this. He's got me chained to the goddamn foot. How are we? Do something, please. He's never gonna let me go. Hmm. Not supposed to use guns and roads. Well, welcome, partner. First time? If it's a gun you're after, you'll want to take a look in the catalog. Whoa, now. That's a fool decision. I want to see what's in that basement of yours. Show me. Right now. Nothing to no worse down there, I swear it. Well, why don't I be the judge of that? Open it now. All right, all right. I ain't got nothing to hide. I got my boy sleeping down there. It's such a shame to wake him. You know, you can always come back after he wakes up. Mm-hmm. Good. Not gonna. You, you just stay away from me. Now what I tell you about talking to your pa that way. Oh, oh, thank God. He can't see I only just what the hell is going on here? He was being a bad little boy, stealing candy from the store again. It's for his own good. I'm not your little boy, you mad son of a bitch. Please help me. He, he's got me chained up here. I don't really like him away from me. He's all I got. Why are you wearing that sailor suit? That crazy maniac put me in it. He thinks I'm his kid's son. Kidnapped me, he did. Do I look like a kid? <laughs> Always in such a rush to grow up. What a fucking weird situation, right? Like, seriously, what are we doing here? Like... These days, aren't they?
Don't shoot me, please. Just, just leave us be. Please don't listen to that maniac. He, he ain't my father. How do I save you? I can't lose him. Not again. Please shoot through these shackles. I, I can't spend another day down here. Come on, please. How the hell can I be his son? Oh, I'd like to shoot through the shackles. I'm never getting out of here, am I? No, the chains! Shoot the chains! Oh, oh, finally! Thank you, thank you. Oh, oh, you, you I'm sorry. Son. Please forgive me. I know it was wrong. I just couldn't face that he was gone. That's fucked up. And sad. And I don't remember it going this way. <clears throat> I was teaching Sammy how to hold the rifle proper out by the river. The recoil shot him backwards. He slipped into the river. The water pulled him downstream so quick. It all happened so fast, I didn't know what to do. I searched up and down that river bank for days. But I couldn't find my boy. I just miss him so much. And you! You remind me of him. You look just like him. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Don't know what else you want from me. Take what you want. I don't care anymore. <laughs> Tell me to take whatever I want, so I will. I'm going to take all that I can. No. He said I could. I guess. Not bad. I mean... Go in the hotel. Well, there it is. Nope. Well. well, then I suppose we can check out. Isn't Dutch? Where's Dutch? Dutch was over here. What happened to Dutch? Hmm. Well, guess we'll do this and then excuse me. Gavin! He's my best friend. He left me. Gavin. I, lost him. I mean, I lost him. Gavin. 
Someone must have seen an Englishman. <laughs> really funny he is. <laughs> hey, mister. Listen, have you seen... I'm looking for my friend, Gavin. I don't know any Gavins, I'm afraid. English bloke. Lovely fella. He went missing, and uh, now I'm all alone. Mm -hmm. Good luck. That's, uh... That's too bad. Yep. Gavin! Gavin! Well, now Dutch is back. Oh, what's... Uh, you know, actually, I should call this to an end. Yeah. I'll put this to an end. Thanks for watching. Um, hope you have a good upcoming work week. Take crazy. Bye.